creating an online reservation. If the person, if the client has terms and conditions, we need to read those and then accept it. Now we can create a reservation. Um, first, we'll select the date we're looking to check in and the length of stay. The ones highlighted in yellow are what is available for that time period and for what each unit type is available for. We can then select which unit type we want to stay under. For this example, we're going to stay in the bed and bunk room. If we select right now it's on one unit, we've applied. If we apply more than one unit, it's going to be seen as a group booking once this feature is enabled or allowed. Um, also, um, there are more than one views. There is a two-week view and a two-month view. Right now, we're currently on the two-week view. If we click on the two-month view, we will then see a larger area um, for availability. We can then go between the u different units types that are available for that time period to see the availability. So we're going to select for the bed and bunk room. Select how much occupants are staying in that room. And click on get quote. We will then enter our email address and password that we would like. If there was none before, you'll see this message letting you know to input that information. Once our information has been input, click on next. If we want any comments that we would like the resort to see, we input them here. We can read our terms and conditions by clicking on this link. And then once we've completed that, we can select that we've read them, click on that set, and then select our method of payment here and process our payments. Thank you.